Quit underestimating branding. It's one of the few things that nullifies all your business's positive attributes if you do it wrong. And it amplifies all of them if done right. Seriously, it's way more powerful than you think and it brings along benefits you probably haven't even thought of. And it might be the only thing holding your business back from reaching the level of attention, reputation, and dollars it deserves. Let's go. Diving into the business realm, you'll often hear the buzzword branding, but there's more depth than meets the eye. Is branding just a well-deserved logo, a catchphrase, a slogan, or an attractive color palette? A brand is a result. It's, it's um, a customer's gut feeling about a product, a service, or a company. It's a sentiment, an emotion, and it's fascinating how this gut feeling isn't just conjured out of thin air. Every touch point, be it an advertisement, customer call, a store visit, or even the unboxing of a product contributes to this feeling. It's a symphony of experiences that create perceptions. So branding isn't just a single element, it's more of a strategy of influence. And with an ever-growing number of options customers have to choose between, clearly showing why you're the best choice is more critical than ever. In today's hyper-competitive marketplace, why do some businesses appear to go viral overnight while others fall on their face? Much of this success can be traced back to the potency of the brand. Imagine wandering through a vast forest. Strong brands act like towering, distinct trees standing out and drawing you in. A brand isn't just an aesthetic choice. It's a company pledge, a promise that resonates with its ethos, values, and character. Research shows that the human brain prefers recognizable brands, and there's comfort in the familiar, a sense of trust. 82% of consumers choose a brand they recognize over an unfamiliar one. But it's not just about recognition. A strong brand evokes emotion, fosters loyalty, and even commands a premium price. And when brands reach in that iconic status, they transcend industries. They're no longer just companies, they become cultural touch points, influencing our daily lives and even our language, such as need a Kleenex? And again, strong brand is so much more than a memorable logo. It defines how and why the product is built, who is hired, and how to connect with users. Ever felt a connection with a brand? More often than not, it's the story behind the brand that resonates with us. And Tesla, for example, isn't just selling cars. They're selling a vision of a sustainable future. And then there's Nike. Just do it. Its campaign wasn't just about sports. It's conveyed perseverance, ambition, and breaking boundaries. Brands aren't just logos or products. They weave relatable moments that resonate deeply with consumers. And according to a study by Stackla, 86% of consumers say authenticity is more important when deciding what brands they support. These narratives, these authentic tales, lead us to trust brands, often guiding our purchasing decisions. A study by Lucid Press indicates that consistent branding across all channels increases revenue by up to 23%. And in essence, when we connect our brand's story, it doesn't just influence our buying behavior. It often becomes part of our own life story. Now, imagine walking into a room filled with strangers. Some faces grab your attention while others seem to blend into the crowd. Your brand in the vast room of the marketplace is very much like a face. It leaves an impression. It's that logo on a product, that color scheme on a website, that jingle in an advertisement. These elements become the face of your business, setting the stage for everything that follows. It's not just about aesthetics. It's about creating a lasting memory, an imprint on the customer's mind. But what happens when there's a need for a brand refresh? When executed right, rebrands can bring significant benefits. For instance, when MasterCard dropped the word MasterCard from its logo in 2019, brand recognition remained strong at 81% globally, emphasizing the power of its iconic red and yellow circles. Similarly, Airbnb's rebrand in 2014 wasn't just about a new logo. It marked a strategic shift focusing on belonging. Following the rebrand, the company's valuation skyrocketed, reaching $31 billion by 2017. And such changes aren't merely cosmetic. A study by The Motley Fool indicated that companies that undergo successful rebrands on average see a 33% increase in revenue over the next fiscal year. Rebranding is a delicate dance between preserving the soul of the brand while aligning with the evolving world. And when this balance is struck, the results aren't just visible, they're quantifiable. When you hear a familiar tune or see a distinct color, ever notice how certain brands immediately come to mind? That's the power of consistent branding at work. It's like hearing the same greeting from a friend every time you meet. That predictability, the familiarity brings comfort. And from the digital landscape of your website to the tangible feel of a business card, every touch point of your brand sets the stage, planting a unified picture. And think about it. If you walked into your favorite coffee shop, 
and it looked entirely different each time, you'd start to feel a bit unsettled, right? And branding works the same way. A harmonious, consistent brand experience builds trust. And according to Forbes, consistent branding across all platforms can increase revenue by up to 23%. And it's not just about boosting sales. A unified brand voice strengthens recognition, fosters loyalty, and ensures your audience feels at home no matter where they interact with your brand. In a world buzzing with countless brands vying for your attention, consistency isn't just key, it's essential. And in the same way people grow and change over time, brands too have their own life cycle. It's a beautiful dance, staying true to one's roots, yet moving gracefully with the changing rhythms of time and market trends. And brands aren't set in stone. They breathe, evolve, adapt, ensuring that they remain relevant to new audiences, fresh markets, and dynamic landscapes. Consider the journey of Starbucks from a simple brown album in 1970s to its contemporary minimalist green siren. While its look transformed, its core, its essence of community and connection stayed intact. And adapting doesn't mean discarding what's core to your identity. It's about understanding what your audience resonates with today while honoring the legacy you've built. So in the end, successful brand evolution is akin to telling a story, a story that continues to unfold chapter by chapter, ever captivating yet ever familiar. It's a journey of growth, ensuring that the heart of the brand beats strong, no matter the changes on the surface. Diving into the depths of branding might leave us wondering, so what? What's the tangible outcome in today's sometimes crazy marketplace? The reality, unsurprisingly, is in the numbers. Brands with strong recognition can command prices up to 13% higher than lesser known competitors. And in other shows, consistent branding can lead to a 23% increase in revenue. But it's more than just the data. It's about building trust and carving out a distinctive space in the consumer's mind. Need proof? Let's turn to Apple. Now, Apple, is one of the half a dozen best brands in the whole world. But even a great brand needs investment and caring if it's gonna retain its relevance and vitality. To me, marketing's about values. And so we have to be really clear on what we want them to know about us. Apple at the core, its core value is that we believe that people with passion can change the world for the better. That clarity in branding not only pulled Apple from the brink, but positioned it as a global leader, a testament to the undeniable power of strong branding. In our exploration of branding, one thing becomes crystal clear. It's so much more than just a visual element. A logo might be the starting point, the seed, but the brand, it's the entire tree. It's the shade it provides, it's the fruit it bears, the seasons it endures. It's not just merely about an aesthetic appeal or market trends, it's the essence, the DNA of a business. It tells the world who you are, what you believe in, and how you wish to make a mark. In essence, branding is a commitment, a commitment to your values, your customers, and the legacy you aspire to create. It's a silent yet powerful ambassador of your vision, making echoes in the minds and hearts of your people. All right, what about you? Who are your favorite brands? Why do they resonate with you? Share in the comments below. And if you're inspired to rethink your brand, start today. For more insights, subscribe and stay tuned to our next video. And you can always download guides at brandatlas.com.